This is an ABC 10 News update. Good evening, I'm Vanessa Van Hefti with this 10 News update. Hundreds gathered at Waterfront Park today in support of women's reproductive rights. Marchers say they should have the choice to decide if or when they want to start a family. They say the decision should not be left up to the court or elected officials. That event part of a nationwide march in response to the new restrictive new abortion laws in Texas. The San Diego County DA announced sexually violent predator Douglas Badger will not be placed in a Rancho Bernardo neighborhood after all. The district attorney's office says because the property owners withdrew their offer to allow Badger to stay in their home, the recommended location was no longer viable. Badger has admitted to raping more than 500 boys and girls dating back to 1974. He has reoffended upon every release. New barriers are up on Pershing Drive to help protect bicyclists from getting hurt. Two San Diegans were recently killed in the area after being hit by cars, inspiring calls for action from the community. San Diego Mayor Todd Gloria has instructed staff to put up barriers there to create bikeways in both directions. This is a temporary fix while Sandeg creates more permanent protected bikeways. Jared Aaron's now with a look at our forecast. And if you didn't like today's heat, you're going to have to put up with it for one more day. Our temperatures tomorrow in the 80s along the coast, 90s inland. But after tomorrow, some big changes for our weather. Coming up, we'll talk about rain in the forecast and temperatures dropping as much as 20 degrees.